Alright everyone, this is Scott Nicholson with an in-play video review of Dungeon Fighter. Now, Dungeon Fighter is a game where you are fighting monsters crawling through a dungeon. This is our little dungeon over here, and what we're doing is we're questing our way all the way up to go and try and fight the big boss. And so each of us are playing a character with special abilities, and what we have to do is roll the die so it bounces off the table and lands on the target. Now, some rooms, like this room for example, is making things harder, and the monster is making it so we actually have to bounce the, uh, the die off of a box to make it land on the target. So typically, the way you'll shoot it is you'll take the die and you'll roll it so it lands on the board, and if it lands on the board, then hooray. If it lands with a special symbol up like that, then you look at your character sheet to see if it triggers a special symbol. I'm playing a healer, for example, so I can heal the party. So each of us have different special abilities. The monsters can make it harder. We have some special weapons. We have a ninja star involved where you can throw a card with two hands to have the dice land on the board. Um, so we've been playing the game now for a little while, and I think we're all pretty frustrated with it. I love the idea of the game, but the thing is, since the dice have flat sides and corners, then many times you throw the die and it just goes bouncing off. But if it lands on a flat side, then that's very good. But what we're finding is we're pretty frustrated with this. We don't feel that we have enough control to really enjoy the game. It could be with practice it works out. But and if you were throwing something that wasn't dice, so you didn't have that random, if it hits a corner, and sometimes you'll throw it, it bounces towards you. I really wanted to like this game, uh, but I'm pretty frustrated with it now. So I don't think it's going to be a game I'm adding to my collection. But it's still a clever idea. Uh, dungeon Fighter sort of adds a bit of a video game mindset to your typical dungeon stomping game. So if you like the idea of making dice bounce and landing on targets, you could take a look at it. So anyway, that's all I have to say about this one. I will talk to you all later. Bye-bye.